Hey everyone, how you doing? If you are new here, I'm Nicole Concilio and welcome to the vlog channel. So today, oh my gosh, you could see my little zit sticker on. We are taking the dogs, we're trying to figure out a new food for Junie because she is having really bad allergies. There's this place in town called The Healthy Spot. They have all organic and really great food for the dogs. So we're gonna head on over there right now. And then we're also gonna check out this furniture place. We really have been wanting to redo our little dining room area. And like, I've always wanted a bigger kind of table there. So we are on our way, just doing a little adventure. Too. Things have been getting a little bit better COVID wise in LA. I feel safe. We're double masking. Don't get me wrong. We are double masking, bish. But I feel a little bit safer going to places, especially places like getting the dog's dog food, like just kind of doing little things like that, not really just going out to go out, just doing things that are necessary. I don't feel comfortable yet to go to restaurants or any of those types of things. Like, And I still order a lot of my groceries off of Instacart because in LA County, the number one places to get COVID are always restaurants and grocery stores. So that's where we're trying to really stay away from. <laughs> has a bowl like this. We were thinking about getting Junie a big one. What do you think, girl? You found the cookies? <laughs> so we're giving this brand a try for little Junie girl, open farm. And then I'm gonna grab some of this stuff, you guys. This is so good if you have a chihuahua that gets upset stomachs all the time. Oh, there they are. Junie needs a little help. And Mo just always hops right up. Go ahead, Mo. Good boy. All right, well, that was successful, you guys. When we get home, I'll show you everything we got. They're always so knowledgeable in the healthy spot. That's why I love going in there and actually talking to them because it's like different than ordering stuff online. Like, I don't really know what to get for dogs with allergies, you know, and they're just so sweet in there. So I'm really happy we did that. All right, so we got the table and the chairs. <laughs> impulsively but yeah we have been redoing parts of the house slowly and it's been really fun so i'm excited to be doing this with you guys and like kind of documenting it it's in it's in it's in it's in all right so this is the table and chairs beforehand i actually wound up purchasing this this was staged furniture when i bought my house i was like well I don't have any table, I don't have anything. But yeah, these chairs are just like, you know, they've worn out their purpose and they don't really go with the vibe that we're trying to do anyway. But here are the new chairs and we just gotta bring the table in. Are you ready for that? Yeah, we want these chairs. We have yeah. these old chairs from the bedroom, you our guys, I'll house. show. I know, our whole house is a mess right now because we're redecorating. All right, guys, you hold down the fort. We're gonna bring in table okay you guys so this is what it looks like in this area i also feel like i want to get mo a darker tp to maybe fit in here but this is what it looks like obviously we i want to get like a different thing in the middle here to style it but it looks so much better and I feel like we have a lot more space as well. And the guy at the furniture store is gonna order us two more chairs so that we can actually fit six people at this table when the pandemic is over one day. The round table came out and you kinda had to yeah, the round table was really big for this corner. I mean, you guys can see it's still right here, but. And you can still, this is, I mean, round tables are cool, but this, we can actually have more people and the table takes up less space. Yeah, so it's a win-win, honestly. Okay, so with the round table, we really didn't have much room and we've always wanted to put 
a plant here in the corner. So I think we're gonna run, there's this place called Armstrong. They're all outside. It's all social distance, really safe. And I think we're gonna run and get a plant to put here because we really wanna add more greenery in the house and just Hold like on. a nice big statement piece. Do you want a plant there? Yeah. Do we get enough light? Wait, are you kidding me? <laughs> These are the only windows in that freaking house. Yeah, but I'm so excited. We actually have a real table and we can fit like six people here, which is like basically the max. Like if Riley's family ever comes to visit, you guys know we've been doing uh, drive downs. We can at least have a table where they can all sit. Like we always had to sit outside, which is, which is fine, but also the weather this time of year is so up and down. It's really nice to be able to have like six people sit at a table in my house. Be honest. Okay. The only reason you wanted this table is so you could put more pompous in the middle. <laughs> Maybe. You know I've been trying to get rid of that circle table for forever, but honestly pompous in the middle makes me excited. All right, let's go to the plant store. Woo! Damn, I guess everybody else is trying to get plants as well. <laughs> So we're looking for indoor plants. Here we go. Ooh, I love little palms. So we're trying to decide right now what would be good for that area. We don't want to get anything too big. All right, so I'm trying to pick out a vase to go with this guy. And I feel like I never knew how expensive plants and vases are. <laughs> okay, so this is the pot we decided on. And this is the plant. Hi, bud. <laughs> Don't judge my yard, you guys. I know it's dead. We're in the process of redoing it. Oh, hi, bud. Hi, queen. There she blows. Oh, she's looking mighty fine. All right, here he is. <laughs> Here comes the bride. <laughs> what? Oh my God, that is so perfect. What does it look like? It looks so good. You gotta move though. What does it look like? I can't tell. <laughs> Damn, I'm good. <laughs> oh my God. But yeah, that's literally such a perfect spot for it. Wow. What? This house looks like a home. June, what do you think? I love it. Good job. I think her name is Blake. You guys, this was fun. We didn't even know that we were gonna do this today. Oh wait, I gotta do my little unboxing, but we bought the dogs. Come um, excuse me, sir. Hey, do, do you already have one? Get away from the new table. These are dental health bones for all breeds and sizes. We got the carrot and hey. pumpkin flavor. This is the indigenous pet products. Pretty cute. They gave us a free, two free bandanas. Oh my God, how cute, we didn't even know. Is that your tartan, June? What is this? Wait, this looks so fire on Junie with her colors. No. Oh, buggy. That's a pretty girl. We got some goat's milk for the dogs, which is apparently supposed to be really good for their like allergies, digestion health. It's, yeah, it's supposed to be really good. I actually used to give this to Mo when I first rescued him. So we're gonna be doing this with the dogs. Then I was talking to you guys about this in the store, but these Nummy Tum Tums, these are the organic pumpkin supplements for dogs. Honestly, Mo, if you have a Chihuahua or a small breed dog, I feel like they're always getting stomach aches. Mo always has stomach aches. Yesterday he ate grass and shit it all out, so that was fun. Um, but I always like to have these available in the house just because of how frequent he gets stomach aches. These I absolutely love because these are more single use. Whereas like this, you open up a can, it's kind of like it sits in my fridge for a week or so until I go through it. But these are more for single use. It's honestly like similar brands. This is the pumpkin puree and you just mix it in with their food. But yeah, that's our little haul from the healthy spot. If you live in LA, I highly recommend checking them out. They are a little expensive, but they are very knowledgeable. Are you gonna go grab Junie's giant food bag and carry it over? Hell no. Come on, it'll be I, fun. I, I'm sorry, buddy. Yeah, I can't do that, fun. it's too heavy. It's almost dinner time, so the dogs are extra amped right now. But okay, do some squats. Whoa! Oh, got it. Uh, 
Wow, this actually would be great to squat in. We gotta change our calendar, it says January. But yeah, we got her open oh, farm and we got her the white fish recipe. We're still waiting for her allergy test to come in. But in the meantime, we're staying away from beef and chicken because that apparently triggers a lot of allergies in dogs. So we're just doing fish right now, but you're gonna try it out for the first time and let us know how you like it. Oh my God, it's my cousin's dog, Pepe. All right, you guys, thank you so much for hanging out. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Leave me a comment down below if you want more home decor and vlog style content. I always have so much fun when I do this, but thank you guys so much for watching. And if you like what you see, please consider subscribing and and I will see y'all next time. Bye.